Hi there and welcome back. It's Tanya from Tattoo Treasures. So this is part four of uh, the lap book, which is using the new collaboration kit from myself <clears throat> and Nanine at Collage Type. Uh, we've both got two different kits um, in our shops and the details are down below in the description. So <clears throat> last time we made uh, this piece, which is going to... Uh, flip here. I have added uh, a couple of cards there and I've put a William Morris postcard, an envelope and some tags in there and I've just put a little photo in each of those. So I'm going to hinge um, this onto here so thinking if I measure that I'm guessing it's about a centimetre yeah just over a centimetre so I've got the scoreboard out um, this is a little bit shorter than I want but it'll be fine um, I'll show you what I mean in a second so sitting a bit a bit awkward I'll oh, hutch in in a minute okay let's just pop that right down there and I will glue this this on let me just bone fold it uh, down so this will be the last video uh, this week of um, this project. I'll carry it on next week because I've got some some other videos that that need to go to go up. So we'll have a couple of days um, off it, and then we'll go back on it. So if you are um, following, um, you know you'll have a few days to to catch up so if I place that Don't put it on like this because it's silly. Let's just put a bit more blue on there. So that's ended up being a bit a bit longer. We'll see. We'll see what it looks like because I'm going to be putting this envelope um, here, and that bit's too too short. But yeah, I don't want that hanging. Off. So let's um, cut that, cut that down. Move that. Okay. So that's going to get stuck <coughs> to there, and then that envelope is going to go on the top. Um, <coughs> I'm going to put a magnet closure on it that so I'm just gonna glue that on and then I'll just put a little bit of tape over it, I'm just using the 
uh, craft tape, the magnets and the tape are on my Amazon favourites if you want to know uh, exactly what they are. So that's going to go like that, let's um, do the same with that one and a little bit of tape okay and that's gonna get stuck to there so I think what I'll do this is pretty wide but I'll keep it keep it as it is I don't think it's adding you know extra bulk on or anything I'm not going to go too close to the edge because um, it's very wet it's kalal and it <coughs> tends to spread its way way out like it has so just make sure that that fits into to that See, this still needs a bit of clay. Okay, make sure that can close. Let's put some extra glue in there. Okay, and I'm going to stick this down um, three three sides I might be best to wait till <clears throat> until this glue uh, dries let's just get some of this glue off put in a right gluey mess I'm putting something down there in a minute anyway right so I'm going to put some glue down here because I obviously don't want it popping out like so <clears throat> and across here and across here like so and I'll just pop that there yep so we've got a pocket underneath and we've got this one okay let me just pop that to give me some room um, <clears throat> I'm going to put a pocket on there and I've got a little a little one out and I was going to put that um, down there where's that little pocket gone sides okay sure I made some little um, cards I don't want to forget about these things um, that I've made that way that needs 
ink in the front of it. Do white. There we go. So that can go in there. <clears throat> I won't push it all the way. <clears throat> and then we want something on there. Oh, I'm going to make that into an altered paper clip. I did that in one of the um, Trash It videos. They're banners, aren't they? I want to pick something to, to cover that. Oh, that's nice. I think I might go for that. And even though it's on thickish card, I feel like I'm going to put it on some more card. So you'll be able to pull that up to, to open it. I just think it needs to be, be a bit thicker. Um, got a little faux stamp there, that's nice. And a little tiny number, so that will be lovely for that. Let's open these up. Here, see how that feels because this isn't very um, thick, it was just um, <clears throat> I've got um, you know, one of those box files. Um, I'd got one of them what was broke, so I took all the um, file parts out. So I've got about 20, 30 pieces of, of this, which is going to be good for, for backing things. I seem to have lots of things for backing at the minute, and I keep using it. But it doesn't seem to go down. Yeah, that's loads better. Okay, so I probably want to glue it. Mm, it's a bit difficult. <laughs> ah, I'm going to be better doing that, aren't I? That's, um, so if I go. Okay, I think that's I think that's all right. That will disappear once it's dry. So that's that bit. Um, <clears throat> so we've got that. I'm gonna have to put something over here um, because of the stickiness. So we'll leave that a minute, and I'm gonna pop that down there. So this is one of the um, washi strips. And if you uh, saw Donna's 
um, video. Um, she printed these washi bits onto a vellum and used them as like washi uh, tape. Look really nice. Uh, Donna's link is in my description, as are all the people who's involved in uh, the collaborations and uh, Nanine's uh, design team. Okay, so that's uh, that bit. Okay, let me think. So in here, I think I was going to have um, these in. So I'll link around these. so I can um, glue around that. I'd not thought about it, to be honest. If I had, I would have um, covered it before before I struck it down. That would have made it a lot easier. So that's that. I'll do the other one. Okay, so I think that one up and I've pulled that out uh, what I'd made in uh, the series before I started this they're all on the same playlist so that can go there I'll put some string in it so you can pull it out I'm thinking of putting this paper on this this is <coughs> um, scrapbook paper from die cuts with a view so I think if I go like this and where's my pencils? Uh -huh. um, <coughs> draw. See what this looks like. I'll cut into the um, before the pencil, so it's smaller rather than um, bigger. I'm filming this, and it is Thursday today, so it's a week um, before you'll see see this we've, we've had some lovely um autumn weather but um yeah it's dark and raining um today so i'll be wet through when i take um colin later i don't think i'll be able to video in it <coughs> Should, should work out all right let's um let's ink all around the edges i'm doing this edge as well just in case <clears throat> any of it shows and thank you to uh, the people that's come over to my uh, second channel I will start and well I'll put it in my um, link tree um, links so I'm going to use that channel to you know talk about more um, what I've been up to um, more chatty uh, videos and try and um, just just stick to, to crafting 
um, on here. Reason being, <coughs> I find if I just start chatting, um, the videos end up being, you know, longer than they need to be. Um, and if you've not come on to listen to me chat, then it's a bit, it's a bit much. And I know, you know, you, people are pushed for, for time. So I thought if I did some small videos on there, um, and showing you, showing you the sights and and things round and about. And if I go out for the day and things, I'll take a little bit of footage, um, and stuff like that. So. And it, it just keeps it keeps it a bit separate because you know not everybody's interested in in me as a as a person I mean I'm not I'm not even that interesting <laughs> not that interesting right obviously we've got some hangover but that that's not too bad let's um open that up but yes, this would have obviously been a lot better to do uh, before gluing down the envelope. Mm, nearly knocked me tea over with my um, elbow. I don't know where I'm going to cut this. I'll have to go this way and just hope. Okay. And then just a bit up here. Yeah, that's awkward. I don't know if I've got any or not. I should have. Just in cap. A bit crease there, but that's fine. I might just put some washi over that bit. Okay, so I'm quite happy uh, with that. So I think in here, if I put, I could put a stamp there just to cover that. Um, where the paper's not covered and I've got those um, black botanical um, stickers on them tie so that's that let's got these strips one of those up, cut it, and I cut that, oh gosh, who knew that things were so difficult to cut, angles and, and things, what's to be? Kind of cut the angle the same, and it will be the same, same way. No, of course it won't. Oh, yeah, of course it will. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, angles throw me. So these strips are a good way just to be able to get and get some of your matching kit to get um I forget the word. Bring 
the ends of the thingy and look at that. That's that. Lovely. So that's brought that in. And then I might as well use one of the, the fussy cut images. That's nice. That's that. Then what can we do on here? No, oh, that's too 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 strippy. Mm. I don't know if just to put a bit of paper down there or not. Too, too similar to, to that. Okay, I've just put a little bit of organza um, on that journal card. I've got memories out, so I thought I'll have that across there. And I'm not going to have any paper on it, I'm just going to leave it um, black. Memories there. Yeah, and then I've got a little butterfly and I was gonna pop pop that there. Like so. And I'm gonna have a go of this um Wink Costello what um the lovely Kimmy sent me. I'm gonna go all the way over it. Oh, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but that's very pretty. Okay. Yeah, nice. So that's uh, that bit. Do I want? Do I want a label or anything? No, I'm gonna leave it um, like that for for now. So <coughs> this part, um, I'm gonna do like a fold out. And I've got some A4. So I was thinking of um, doing that. So I'll need to put a hinge on it there. That's, um, and I only want to, I mean, I don't want it as far as, as far as that. Let me just... I don't know how long that takes to dry. If I score this at half, that will be um, 
the hinge and then if I do it so that's where that is I didn't want it as long as, as that so let's, let's do it there that like that and just score it kind of where it where it meets okay so that will be like that so I've got to score each side and then I can attach this to here and if I score that Cut it off. <clears throat> okay, so there's my bone folder gone. There it is. So that's where I'm going to stick it onto the um, book, and that's going to be when it folds in. Half. and then that's going to be the bit that connects to the next sheet it's not flush lot there's I've got a little step from there to there then we're going to pop that into there so let's uh, glue down here So I've not made a, a prototype or anything. I'm literally just just making it up. And obviously, you know, you do size to to what you're doing. I could have, you know, gone done more um, to add on to it. Okay, so I push that up to there, making sure that the top and the bottom meet yep. and then I don't have to fold it over I suppose it could be a little tuck couldn't it straight like this. I don't think it is, is that? Let me get the scoreboard. Because <coughs> it was only at my feet. Oh, well, this seems a bit chunky. Yeah, obviously it's not, it's not in any of the um, scores. So, I'll go to the next one and that might give me a bit of a the gusto, I don't mind. You know, it goes into that other one anyway. So yeah, that just goes to show 
and that it wasn't straight. Let's um, turn it turn it over and do this one. I've got no idea um, what I'm doing with that. I don't know if to just keep that like that and just put um, a tab on it, which I don't think I want it as, as long as, as that. So let me just take a little bit off. some of this material couldn't I for a for a tab of that on there let's do that then have I got a wider piece no no um let me just cut that down a little bit So, I think, well, I don't know, actually. I, I was going to say I don't know if to just put writing pages over them. Because I could do that on one side, couldn't I? I have one side as writing and one side with pockets. Yeah. So I'm going to get this uh, glued in because I'm not going to, you know, totally cover cover it <clears throat> so I don't feel that I need it out to, to cover it. So that's going to go like that. Now... that way okay so let's take let's take this down on that little hinge Okay. And then we've got 
that there. So I'd got um, these out to go here. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to try and hide it. I think it looked a bit awkward when, when I did. I'll just cut this other one down a little bit. Because that one's just a little bit bigger. Oh, I'm going to do it on the chopper. which I'm going to put on there <clears throat> like so. So I'm just going to trim, trim round and ink around them and then we'll get that down. Okay, they're all inked so I'll get this um, pocket on. So I think off camera I'll get the um, plain papers on. And I think it like I'll either put something at the top of the page or the bottom of the page, either a sticker or just a little embellishment from the from the kit. I don't know why I've done that. There's a little bit hanging down. I didn't notice it until I went to stick it down. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to connect these first just so I can see um, where they go. Yep. Normally works. Not today. <laughs> oh no, not today. Okay. I don't think that's straight. Oh, I'm glad I did it that way made my life so much easier not okay that's better Oof. okay <coughs> so I'm not going to glue, I'm going to glue, oh hold on, no I'm not, I'm going to glue uh, down the three sides so the top pocket goes all the way down so it's a nice big pocket and then we will call it a day for today and like I say I'll be back um, next week uh, with the excellent finishing off the uh, book challenge videos and I've got the postcard challenge I've got um, your creative studio um, unboxing and I've the new planner uh, kit for next year 
and um yeah we're gonna it's different this year to, to how we had it last year um but i'll tell you more about that in in that video okay so that's that i think that needs a bit of something i don't know what i think i've got that out for it so i'll ink around here That's a double one. Just on the side. Should have printed some clock faces on. I think that they would have been nice um, with this kit and some of the some of the rollers. Because yeah, Nanin does have a fussy cut um, kit with rollers in and one with clocks on. Because um, I'm feeling that I want something uh, round. Maybe not. Ooh. I just trim that a little bit. I could have that on there. I like that. Oh, I can just bring it in a little bit. Yes, I like that. And oh, shall we have grateful? Yeah. So that needs a trim, trim run. So I'll leave it at, at that. Um, I'm going to put a couple of those long um, tags in at the back and um yeah i'll see you next next week with it so bye for now